Hey y'all, what's up? This your girl, Comatic Medium Prophetess, and I'm back with another video. If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. Hello. If you're new, I am a prophetic tarot reader. I do not read cards based off the meanings. I read cards based off what spirit tells me, the holy angels and the divine. Also, a psychic medium. I'm able to connect with those who have crossed over. All right, you guys, this is going to be a general collective message. Remember to take what resonates, leave what don't. I really don't know what's going to come out, but I am kind of getting a download. So we're definitely going to see what's going on. Today is, what is today? Today is September the 28th, Saturday. Happy birthday, Libra. I'm a Libra. I'm a double Libra. So happy birthday. Shout out to all the Libras out there that's celebrating their birthday. Happy birthday, Libra. And shout out to all of the air signs, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, all of the 12 zodiac signs. I hope you guys are enjoying your day. Uh, yeah, Libra. There you are, Libra. Empress card here. Libra energy. Okay. Libra Taurus energy. Somebody could definitely be the Empress. Libra. Justice. That bitch or that nigga. You, you the shit. Divine masculine, divine feminine. So, yeah, right off the bat, look, I'm talking about you. Happy birthday, Libra. Okay, and all of my empresses out there. All right, Ace of Swords here. So we're just going to see what's going to come out. High Priest is here. I feel like somebody is jealous and envious of you because you're beautiful. You're smart. You're intelligent. You're beautiful. You speak the fucking truth, too. With the Empress and the Ace of Swords, you're beautiful as fuck, and you speak the truth. Somebody is jealous and envious of you because you're intuitive, you're beautiful, and what else can I say? Okay, you're a Libra like me, you're that bitch, or you that nigga, male or female, you are the empress or the emperor, period, point blank. We don't read gender in tarot, divine masculine, you could be in an empress energy. You're somewhere relaxing, rejuvenating, somebody could be getting their nails done today. All right, you guys, Ten of Wands here. Yeah, I feel like somebody wants the fucking Empress. Somebody wants the Empress to carry burdens. These are not your burdens to carry. This is somebody else's burden. Somebody wants the Empress to go through karma. Somebody wants the Empress to be broke. Five of Pentacles here. Somebody does not want the Empress to be with a King of Pentacles. Somebody is mad because you're with your divine counterpart. You're with the man that spoils you, that takes care of you. Angel number 228 on the clock. Somebody's birthday can be 929. Somebody's birthday could be 928. Somebody is jealous and envious. This could be your ex with the four with the four of pentacles here. Queen of Cups. I feel like this is your energy, divine feminine. Excuse me, Libra. Okay, I'm not doing a Libra reading. Why the fuck? I don't <laughs> this is just a general collective message. So you don't have to be a Libra, but I feel like whoever you are, this is your energy. This Queen of Cups, Empress card, High Priest is your intuitive, you're sexy, you're fine. Somebody could be going to the gym. Somebody dr drinks a lot of smoothies or somebody drinks a lot of like shakes. I'm hearing like a child. Chocolate shake, a vanilla shake, or you drink vanilla smoothies, vanilla shakes, strawberry. I don't know. Somebody loves to work out. Somebody eats properly. Yeah. And somebody speaks the fucking truth as well. And somebody is royalty. You see these grapes right here? Somebody doesn't do anything. You don't bother anybody. You mind your fucking business. All you do is eat your fruit, drink your water, and speak the fucking truth and sit on your throne with the empress. Because like the empress that you are, male or female, you're that bitch or you're that nigga. You're very loving. You're very caring. You don't bother anybody and somebody is jealous as fuck because, excuse me, because you're in a relationship. One second. <laughs> Spirit, slow down the downloads. I feel like somebody is jealous as fuck. Spirit is telling me to take my time with this energy, and I also need to go ahead and pray, all right, because the downloads are coming on fast, okay? And again, I'm going to keep repeating this. If this is not your story, don't try to make it fit. Don't get in the comment section saying a bunch of dumb stuff. But somebody is jealous and envious of you because you're with the man that takes care of you. This king of pentacles loves you. He spoils you. He takes care of you. Take care of you. He takes you out to eat. He takes you on trips. He takes you on outings. He loves your kids. I don't know. You may love his kids. You guys could have a blended family. I don't know. Male or female. Okay, this man or this woman adores you. I'm hearing, I adore you. Being with you is amazing. The affection you display does the right thing to me. Your special touch is a rare one in despair. 
and divine feminine girl. Why do I keep saying divine feminine? But this could be for you too, divine master. I don't know. If you're not already with this king of pentacles, you finna be. This man is gonna spoil you rotten. Somebody could be a crip or a blood. I'm wow. Oh my God. But yeah, somebody could be a crip or a blood. You see these grapes right here on this ace of swords. And then you see these grapes right here on this king of pentacles. Somebody wants to feed you grapes. I'm literally seeing this man lay in a hammock and eat grapes and eat fruit. Whoever is interested in you, divine feminine, this man wants to date you. Okay. He can live overseas. Okay. He can live by a big body of water. I'm hearing big body bins. I used to be dusty. I feel like your ex is fucking dusty. That's what I'm hearing. And this person wants you to be dusty. This person is trying to project their insecurities onto you, their karmic ass energy, their burdens onto you. Somebody is mad. I keep hearing somebody's thoughts. Maybe I'm piggybacking a little bit off the last reading that I did. Somebody is jealous of you, divine feminine. And this can literally be a man. This could be a king of pentacles in the reverse that's jealous of you. Your baby daddy, your ex-husband, your father. This could even be your fucking father that's jealous of you. Somebody is jealous of you because you're fucking beautiful. You're beautiful. You're sexy. You're handsome. You're fine. You're all of that you're smart you're intelligent you're intuitive and your number three 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 could be significant two 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 could be significant and somebody is a selfish fuck somebody is a selfish fuck and somebody is a fucking loser with the five of cups here this is somebody that lost you somebody is in regret now somebody is crying now somebody is sad now somebody wants to apologize to you now somebody wants to reconcile with you now somebody regrets how they treated you yeah confirmation and your number um Engine number 157 on the clock. Yeah, eight of wands here. Somebody wants to rush towards you. Somebody Now somebody wants to apologize to you. Now somebody wants to reconcile with you because you're with somebody else. This could definitely be somebody that left you out in the cold. One second. Okay, you guys, I'm sorry about that. I had to go fix my baby's TV, but I'm back. Okay, let's jump back into the reading. Okay, but like I was saying, yeah, four swords here. I feel like this is your bitch-ass ex. This don't have to be an ex. This could be a family member, but I'm literally seeing a man. I'm seeing a man that's jealous of the empress, okay? This could be a king of pentacles in the reverse. This could be your father. This could be your baby father. This could be your ex-husband, your ex-wife, your baby mama, your baby daddy, whatever the fuck. I feel like I'm piggybacking off of the last reading reading that I did. Somebody is jealous and envious of you, but I really feel like this could be a man that's jealous of a woman. There is a grown ass, burly ass, big sloppy ass man or funky ass gay. Somebody is gay. Somebody is gay and somebody is on the down low. Okay. Somebody can secretly sleep with men. All somebody does is watch, watch you behind the scenes with the two of wands here. Somebody is stuck with the 10 of wands. Yeah. Somebody look at all these wands. Look at all these staffs. Yeah. I'm seeing a bunch of fives as well. Yeah. With the five of pentacles and the five of cups, I wouldn't be surprised if the five of wands and five of swords didn't come out. I feel like that's this person. Person's energy. This person is in the two of wands, the ten of wands, the five of pentacles, and the five of cups. And again, I wouldn't be surprised if the um if the five of wands and the five of swords didn't come out, somebody is a fucking loser and somebody is a pervert as well. I feel like somebody sits behind the scenes and jacks their dick off to you. This could literally be your father that's doing this or, or, or your, or a male cousin. I'm here. Somebody posts a lot of pictures on Instagram or somebody could be trying to locate you or find you on Instagram and you're not even on Instagram. You don't even have an Instagram. I told you, yeah, Gemini energy lover's card. This could be an ex lover here, or maybe you do have an Instagram. Somebody could be an Instagram model or you should be. You're very fucking beautiful. Yeah, queen of pentacles here. I feel like you're not focusing on this person. You're focusing on getting money and somebody is jealous of you. I'm seeing somebody drinks a lot of smoothies. This is a divine feminine. Yeah, ten of pentacles here. You work out. You're very sexy. You have a beautiful waistline. Yeah, somebody is fine as fuck and I feel like your karmic ass baby daddy ex-husband. What did I tell you? Five of swords. Didn't I tell you the five of swords was going to come out or this could be your father. Your father could secretly be attracted to you. Two of wands here. Angel number 222 could be significant. Somebody is a fucking pervert. Somebody could be attracted to their own fucking child. This could literally be your father. This could be your uncle. Or this is somebody, a uh, trigger warning. This is somebody that could have molested you or raped you when you was a child. Yeah, justice card here. And they finna go to jail for this shit. Maybe you finally told something or maybe you're gonna expose something. I don't fucking know. Or they went to jail for this shit when they were, when you were a child and somebody has gotten out or I don't know what the fuck this is, but somebody is definitely facing jail time. I'm hearing court fees. Wow. So your ex, 
So divine feminine, divine masculine, your ex with the lover's card here, Gemini energy. Somebody is a fucking hater as well. Spirit, slow down the downloads. Your ex could be facing jail time for raping somebody, for touching a child. Okay, somebody could have lied on this person or this person could have really did this shit. Somebody could have slept with an underage child, a young girl or a young boy. I'm hearing something about statutory rape. Okay, somebody is a fucking pervert. Angel number 1111 uh, on this uh, justice card. And again, with this Libra, I mean, with this Empress card and this Justice card, there, there could literally be another Libra that's attacking a Libra. Maybe that's why I keep picking up on Libra energy. Okay, so there is a whole Libra attacking another Libra. This could be a male Libra that's attacking a feminine Libra. Somebody is just jealous of you. Somebody is jealous of you and envious of you. And this could literally be your own father. I don't know. Yeah, Sun card here. Something is about to be exposed about this person. I feel like somebody keeps trying to attack you, Divine Feminine, Empress. Somebody keeps trying to attack your beauty, to attack your looks, attack your money with the Ten of Pentacles. Didn't the Nine of Pentacles come out? Oh, or no, I probably... It probably came out earlier because I had attempted to do this reading, but the video cut off. I remember seeing the Nine of Pentacles. But yeah, the Nine of Pentacles could be significant as well. Somebody is jealous of your look. Somebody is jealous of your money. Somebody is jealous of your home. Somebody is fucking jealous of you. Somebody is a jealous, envious fuck. I don't know. You could have Leo placement. Some of you could be a Leo. Okay, you could have heavy Leo, heavy Libra in your chart. I feel like you and this karmic ass man or you and this karmic ass woman, you guys could actually have a similar birth chart. And this person is evil, though. It's like you're in the upright. So I feel like somebody keeps looking into your birth chart. Somebody knows something about birth charts or somebody sorry ass mama or family members or I don't know. Somebody could have taught somebody how to look into somebody's birth chart and somebody knows that they have a similar birth chart as you. But they're trying to uh, switch destinies with you. Somebody wants to be seen as you and you seen as them. And this is why they're going to fucking die. I feel like somebody also keeps doing death spells on you. Somebody wants you dead. This fake ass king of cups that's planning to rush in towards you. Somebody wants to apologize to you. Somebody wants to love bomb you. And I feel like you don't want to hear this shit. This is a losing ass ex or this is a losing ass family member or all the above. Ex friends, ex lovers, co-workers, a whole community, whatever the fuck this is. Somebody is mad because you're a truth speaker. You could be a whistleblower like myself. Somebody is a jealous fuck that's going to jail. Eight of swords here. This is what they want for you you but instead it's happening to them yes yeah, seven of wands here i feel like somebody keeps working in cahoots with they sorry ass family this could be your baby mama divine masculine this could be your baby daddy divine feminine ex-husband ex-wife somebody keeps working in cahoots with a community of people their friends their family to go against you and you don't give a fuck with the nine of pentacles here you're somewhere loving on yourself you could be planning a vacation with the knight of staffs here i'm telling you somebody's divine counterpart is here protecting you in the spirit and they might be protecting you in the physical if you're already with this person. Ten of swords here. This is betrayal after betrayal after betrayal after betrayal. Somebody keeps trying to fucking sacrifice you. I wouldn't be surprised if the devil card didn't come out. Two of pentacles here. Somebody is broke as fuck. Somebody is a fucking loser. Somebody is gay. Somebody is fucking retarded and incompetent and slow. Seven of cups here. This is somebody that spreads lies and rumors about you. They talk about you all fucking day. And I feel like this person's friends and family, they're tired of hearing this person talk about you, but they'll never tell this person that this per these this this person's friends and family are sick and tired of this person uh, bringing your name up, divine masculine, divine feminine, talking about you. Everybody around this person is tired of this person. Nobody likes this person. I feel like you were the only person that loved this person or cared about this person. I feel like whoever this person is surrounded by, they're all snakes. They're all bottom feeders. They're all peasants. I feel like these people condone this 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 gossiping. They condone this spell work. They're all jealous of you. This could be a whole family full of people that's jealous of you this could be your family or this could be your ex's family or this could be a community whatever the fuck this is seven of cups somebody is mad because the defamation of character the lies and the rumors that they spread on you it didn't work look at these motherfucking people the seven of wands keeps coming it came out twice all of these motherfucking people keep going up against you, divine masculine, divine feminine, and you're still beautiful. You're somewhere sunbathing, okay? You could be trying to uh, sunbathe before the winter time comes in because you know it's getting cold. The weather is changing. I feel like somebody is going to die. Somebody is going to literally fucking pass away around the winter time with the death card here because this is a dirty ass motherfucker that keeps doing death magic on you. Somebody keeps trying to sacrifice you. And I feel like, yeah, they're blocked. Two of swords here. This is somebody that cannot come down your dwelling. They're mad. All of the lies and the rumors that they spread on you. Somebody keeps attacking you and attacking you and attacking you. Betrayal after betrayal after betrayal. And I feel like you pray for this person. 
You actually pray for this person. You actually still care for this person. Or maybe you don't care for this person. Even if you don't care about this person, even if you don't give a fuck and they're mad about that too. If you don't care about this person at all, they're mad because you're not paying them attention. You don't give a fuck about their gay ass relationship. You don't give a fuck about them being on the down low if they are or if they're not. You don't give a fuck about them having an incurable STD. You just don't give a fuck. Five of cups here coming out again. What you do give a fuck about is your divine counterpart. Knight of staffs here. This sexy ass man that lives overseas. This sexy ass man. This sexy ass king of pentacles that's going to feed you grapes. Somebody wants to feed you grapes on a hammock and somebody want to give you back shots too. And I'm hearing it's going to be real good. Whoever your ex lover is, family, these are, these are people that claim that they love you. They're supposed to love you, but they don't. They're all fucking jealous of you. This could be a community of people, the neighborhood, the town that you live in, the state that you live in. You may be planning to move. Maybe you will move or maybe you're going to or somebody wants to kick you out of a home or kick you out of a community. It's a bunch of jealous ass fucks or somebody, I don't know, this could be your family. So your family could have abandoned you and left you out in the cold and these people are mad because you're not paying them any attention. You don't give a fuck about these people. They're all fucking miserable. They're all going through karma. What the fuck is this? <laughs> These are a bunch of fucking losers. These are nothing but fucking losers with losers with the lovers card here, man. Somebody's ex is so jealous of you. Somebody is worried about the wrong thing. Somebody wants to know who you're sleeping with. Somebody wants to know who you're having sex with. I feel like it's a group of people that's mad because they can't get information on you. So they keep telling lies. Somebody ain't talked to you. Somebody ain't heard from you. Somebody just be lying. Somebody is delusional as fuck. Like somebody could have said, oh, I talked to Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine yesterday and they haven't heard from you in months. Months. They haven't heard from you in years. Oh my God, Spirit, slow, slow down the downloads. There's so much shit going on. Yeah, page of swords here. I mean, page of coins here with the judgment. Somebody is under fucking judgment because they're a manipulator with the seven of swords here. They're a liar. They're a fucking snake. And this person is mad because you don't fucking want them. And this is somebody that could have rejected you or this person or these people are mad because you don't want to be a part of your own family because they're all fucking snakes. They're all peasants. They're all bottom feeders. And all of these retarded ass people People keep doing death magic and death spells. What, what don't the fuck don't you get? What don't you get, bitch? Divine masculine and not divine feminine is not your blood sacrifice. Yeah, the nine of pentacles could definitely be significant. I keep seeing that the nine of pentacles and the nine of cups, angel number nine nine nine, could be significant. That's a powerful ass angel number. What don't you get? Divine masculine, divine feminine, it's not your blood sacrifice. We're not you guys a sacrificial lamb. I just did a channel message about my damn self last night. You're not gonna blood sacrifice somebody. If anybody is gonna die, if anybody is gonna pass away, bitch is gonna be this bitch ass. Scorpio or this bitch ass karmic Libra or Leo or Gemini, whatever fucking sign of this cancer Pisces Scorpio, you're going to die, bitch. Not divine masculine, divine feminine. You keep trying to play God in somebody's life. You keep trying to call judgment. You want somebody carrying burdens. You want somebody broke and ugly and bummy and disgusting and, and nasty and a hoe. And bitch, won't you go fucking suck somebody, bitch, and get an incurable STD? I feel like you already did, bitch. You're mad because this beautiful ass woman or this sexy ass man, they're not itching and burning. They don't have HIV AIDS. They don't have herpes you do bitch you're mad because you could not destroy somebody's life you and your karmic ass friends and family members whatever the fuck this is bitch star card here confirmation aquarius energy you're mad because somebody is beautiful they're handsome they're in the public eye or they're destined to be a fucking star yeah you're mad because somebody is protected by the most high god and they're chosen bitch and you can't motherfucking sacrifice them with the devil card you're fucking mad you're fucking mad and you're a loser you're mad because you can't fucking bread from somebody bitch you dumbass fool cups here and you're also motherfucking mad hangman here because you're stuck and somebody is enlightened and somebody is in is, is intuitive with the high priestess yeah you're mad because somebody is intuitive and they call you out on their bullshit they're fucking beautiful they're handsome whatever the fuck you're mad you're mad bitch because you're up under judgment and you facing jail time won't you go pay your motherfucking court fees oh because i feel like somebody got court fees to pay you're mad bitch because you're stuck in this hangman energy with living your miserable ass fucking life and divine masculine, divine feminine is somewhere happy eating grapes in a hammock or they finna be. If you're not already with your divine counterpart, divine masculine, divine feminine is coming with the hangman here. Somebody is mad that you're enlightened. They're stuck as fuck. Okay, yeah, with the hangman in the reverse, that represent enlightenment. Uh, yeah, in the upright, that means somebody is stuck. I feel like, yeah, somebody is stuck in fucking karmicville because they're a loser. Somebody keeps trying to break you. Leo energy here, strength card. Somebody is mad because they can't fucking break you. They cannot control you. They can't play God 
in your life and they're mad because they can't sacrifice you. This is your family. This is ex-lovers. My ear is ringing. My right ear is ringing. Excuse me, you guys, showing my bra. <clears throat> but yeah, uh, my right ear is ringing. So that's confirmation. That's my spirit guides. But yeah, somebody is fucking mad because they cannot sacrifice you. They can't get rid of you. And these are people that are supposed to love you. They're supposed to care about you. These are your family members. They're ex. These people don't care about you. They're all fucking jealous. These people are mad because they're miserable. And the devil finna motherfucking collect their ass. Yeah, four of swords here. Angel number 444 four, four could be significant. Yeah, king of wands here. This could be you, divine masculine, or this could be a karmic ass masculine, a karmic ass loser. I don't know, but I'm seeing two men here, divine, uh, divine feminine. Be real careful because there is a warlock or this nigga that sold his soul. I don't know. Somebody is trying to rush towards the empress with the eight of wands. Somebody wants to apologize because they're facing jail time. I'm telling you, somebody definitely owes somebody some back child support or some type of money, and they're mad about that. This warlock, devil card here. Somebody could be a double Capricorn, or yeah, somebody could be a Cancer as well. Somebody is mad because you moved on and you don't fucking want them male or female you don't want this retarded ass person yeah need help somebody need help somebody keeps getting readings on you somebody keeps watching tarot messages on you you could be a tarot reader like myself queen of swords or somebody mad because you cut them the fuck off and you don't want them they're a fucking loser and they stink somebody ass stink i'm literally seeing this this is a gay ass bitch this king of wands here this that's a top or a bottom somebody takes it up the ass somebody takes it up the throat this is a gay ass bitch that's a obsessed with trying to destroy a beautiful ass woman or this is a gay ass woman that's trying to destroy a man you're not a man you're not a woman you're not a fucking empress you're not a fucking emperor you are a warlock or a dark witch you're enough you're a peasant and a bottom feeder and i feel like this is somebody that sold they sold to the devil this is somebody that tried to sacrifice you this could be a family member or an ex-lover whatever the fuck this is this is somebody that tried to fucking sacrifice you get rid of you and they're mad because the devil finna collect they motherfucking ass and they know it somebody knows that they finna die and they don't even give a fuck somebody is evil to their motherfucking core somebody yeah this king of swords this male fucking libra this bitch keeps coming out somebody is a fucking loser i feel like somebody mama is a fucking loser somebody's mother this this king of swords mother could be attacking you divine feminine this king of swords and a retarded ass a crackhead ass a orangutan a, a retarded ass mama could be fucking attacking you sun card here yeah i'm exposing this shit yeah death card here somebody is finna fucking die pass away three of pentacles here eight of wands here what did i tell you be careful somebody wants to ruin your fucking life divine masculine divine feminine male or female we don't read gender in tarot with the eight of wands here somebody wants to come towards you and ruin your fucking life somebody wants to ruin your destiny or they're mad because it didn't it didn't work you're protected by the most high god with the higher thing coming out and somebody is mad because they're facing jail time somebody is going to jail for gang stalking you illegally surveillancing you it's a group of fucking people whatever this is with the three of pentacles because this could be family this could be ex-lovers ex-friends people in your community these people are mad because you're not dead yet. You ain't dying. You ain't passing away. You're not anybody's sacrificial lamb. Neither am I. Bitch, get the fuck over it. Three of staffs. You guess. What did I tell you? Three of stats with the ace of cups, period. You're blessed, you're beautiful, you're handsome, and you're going to remain that way, and you're going to get back shots. Somebody is worried about you getting back shots, and you getting fucked, you are getting fucked. You're getting some real good dick, or you're getting some real wet-ass coochie. You can, yeah, you're getting some WAP, Divine Masculine, or you're getting some good D-I-C-K. Somebody is a jealous fuck and a jealous loser. Your family, ex-friends, ex-lovers, whatever the fuck. Ace of pentacles with the ace of cups, you're blessed. This is your fucking money. These are your fucking blessings. Whoever the fuck this person is or these people are, get a life. Move on with your retarded ass life and stop getting readings on somebody. I feel like there is a hating ass tear reader as well. There could literally be another tear reader that's hating on another tear reader. This bitch is mad because she's going through karma. This nigga is mad. I don't know. I'm hearing something about the spiritual community. Yeah, eight of pentacles here. Bitch, it's not a fucking comments competition. Now, now I'm picking up on the spiritual community. It's not a fucking competition. It's a lot of gifted and talented tarot readers. You're not the only gifted and talented tarot reader, bitch. Stop fucking competing with somebody. And I feel like the more you attack this tarot reader, this tarot reader is going to end up on TV. Somebody's going to be a world-renowned star, bitch. And you're going to be stuck on fucking YouTube or TikTok still attacking somebody. And they're going to be long fucking gone, bitch. I feel like somebody's going to... I don't know, bro. I feel like if somebody is attacking, on, attacking you on 
on your platform. This can literally be another tarot reader if you're a tarot reader. Okay, you might not know it, but I'm, I'm I'm revealing it to you. Or this could be somebody that's even fucking attacking me. Keep attacking me, bitch, and watch what's going to fucking happen because the devil came out twice. You bitches are going to be sacrificed, bitch. You're going to be a blood. Divine masculine, divine feminine is not somebody's blood fucking sacrifice, ho. So get over it, bitch. One second. <clears throat> Excuse me, you guys. I'm sorry. I'm getting so many motherfucking downloads. All these fucking losing ass people in this energy. Just move on with your life. Why are you so worried about divine masculine, divine feminine? Move on. But like I said, this could literally be another tear reader attacking another tear reader. It's not a fucking competition, bro. I feel like somebody is somebody's karma. They're not going to jail. They're not going to prison or nothing. This could be somebody that's stealing your revenue. I feel like you steal from a lot of people. Or this could be a conglomerate. If this is not another tear reader, this could literally be YouTube or TikTok that keep attacking uh, gifted and talented people. I'm hearing they love to attack black women. Trust me, I know. I've been on YouTube for a while and these bitches attack me as well. It's a whole racist ass conglomerate that's going to go down. I feel like there's several people that got lawsuits. There's several people that's going to end up with a lump sum of money because this, this conglomerate, YouTube, TikTok, they keep fucking attacking people. They keep stealing pe from people. They keep trying to destroy people. And I'm hearing black women. This is a group of racist ass motherfuckers that don't like the fact that black women are beautiful, gifted, and talented and black men as well. They don't want black people in the spiritual community because we're waiting people up they want us to be christians and ain't nothing wrong with being a christian okay because i was a christian for years i believe in god I, I was raised in the church and i'll never stop believing in god but they always want to call us fucking witches and warlocks no bitch you're the witches and warlocks because true christians they don't attack people in the spiritual community they focus on their religion you motherfuckers are you you religious ass motherfuckers are worried about terror readers so this could be somebody that's connected to some type of church or something like that i don't i don't, I don't want to read on this shit i'm not gonna pick up on these church motherfuckers not today because i feel like that's a whole nother story Line, but it's definitely some church motherfuckers that's hating on tear readers. I feel like somebody is trying to take somebody's spiritual gifts, this pastor or this wannabe first lady or this pastorette, whatever the fuck this is. Somebody is trying to steal somebody's spiritual gifts. They're mad. Uh, the uh, Joel Osteen could be significant. TD fakes. Uh, yeah, TD Jakes. I said fakes, but yeah. Somebody could be jealous because you're a shaman energy. I don't know what this is, bro. It's some religious ass motherfuckers. It's a religious occult. I'm hearing Houston, Texas could be significant. Austin, Texas could be significant because T.D. Jakes, I believe his church is in Dallas. I've been there one time. It was years ago, years ago, years ago when I was about nine or 10 years old. Okay, so T.D. Jakes could be some significant or this could be some weird ass pastor that wants to steal a tear reader's gift. Somebody wants to steal your gifts, but they're calling you a devil wor worshiper. They're calling you a witch they're trying to pray out the uh the, the tarot out of you they're trying to pray, pray out pray out your spirituality somebody is trying to steal your spiritual gifts so they can use them for themselves but yet they're calling you a warlock yet they're calling you a fucking witch bitch get out of here bitch somebody thinks that they're gonna steal a tarot reader spiritual gift spirit slow down the downloads i'm sorry you guys <clears throat> If it sounds like I'm talking a mile a minute like I'm literally getting download 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 <clears throat> one second Somebody literally wants to steal somebody's spiritual gift. Somebody, this is a pastor or a first lady. Or this could be a fraternity brother or a sorority sister. Somebody could be a Mason or an Eastern star. Okay, maybe they're not a pastor or a pastorette or a first lady. This could be a group of Mason and Eastern stars that want to steal tear readers' gifts. These people are part of fraternities and sororities. Somebody is mad because you won't join. But did you even ask Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine, did they want to join? No, you, you're trying to force them to join. You don't even fucking know this man. You don't know this woman. You're going to force somebody to join. 
but you haven't asked them anything. I don't feel like anybody has came up to you, Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine, and said, hey, do you want to join this occult? Because they know that you're going to turn them down because they know that you serve the Most High God. They know that you don't worship the devil. Somebody wants to steal your spiritual gifts, so they're trying to take your spiritual gifts. Somebody is mad because you expose something or you expose them or whatever the fuck. Or maybe you bitches are mad at me. I don't know what the fuck this is. I just read the fucking energy. Yeah, eight of pentacles here. Somebody is trying to block and stop somebody because they going to jail. It's, there is some type of religious occult Oh, or this is some type of um, Masons or Eastern Stars, fraternity, sorority sisters. I don't know what the fuck this is, but move on with y'all retarded ass life. You're not going to sacrifice a chosen one. If anything, the devil is going to collect. I keep seeing this with the devil card coming out twice. The devil is going to collect, bro. Somebody truly believes. And this is what I'm seeing in my third eye. Looking at this world card here, it's going to be a completion. There's definitely an ending happening. I feel like if somebody has been doing death magic and spell work on you to kill you, somebody is literally trying to kill you with graveyard magic, graveyard dirt, and this shit has backfired. This person or these people could have did this shit in the past. I'm hearing this is, a, this is an occult. This is an occult that your family is connected to, a community is connected to, or your ex. This can definitely be somebody's ex that tried to sell your, uh, that tried to sacrifice you. Somebody sold they sold to the devil, and they put you up as a motherfucking sacrifice. Now this bitch-ass nigga or this woman, somebody can have an incurable S. TV, somebody is losing their fucking mind. Queen of Pentacles here, bro. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles here. This could be an ex of yours that chose a gold digger. There's somebody that put you in a third party. Five of Wands. There goes that Five of Wands. I told you, uh, Page of Cups. This could be somebody that you got children with. I don't fucking know. Somebody is a fucking loser, bro. Yeah, somebody actually believes. I don't know what this is. Angel number 21, 21 could be significant. 222, 11, 11 could be significant. You see this unk up here on this card? Somebody is mad because you have a golden womb or you have a golden penis. You have a golden vagina or a golden penis. You're fucking royalty. You can produce anything. You can manifest anything. Somebody is trying to steal your sacred energy. Somebody is also attacking somebody's crown chakra. And somebody also wants somebody to shut the fuck up. No, bitch, you shut the fuck up. You're not going to get somebody to stop speaking because they're fucking exposing you, bitch. I hope you're not trying to shut me the fuck up. I'm going to keep talking. I'm going to keep fucking exposing you bitch ass people, whether you like it or not. I was called to do this. I am a fucking divine feminine. I am the empress and I'm a double fucking Libra. I'm going to get justice every fucking time, bitch. I was called to do this by my spirit guides and the higher ups. So what the fuck do you want? It's going to be a completion. It's going to be an ending, bitch. Page of cups here. I'll clarify this in a minute. Ten of cups here. This is a whole fucking occult that's attacking somebody or this is your family or this is your... Whatever the fuck this is, bitch, you finna be removed permanently from this earth because I'm seeing the Grim Reaper finna come get somebody, bitch. And these people are mad because you don't care. Somebody wants you to care. If this is your ex's family, your ex's family is mad because you don't care about this person. Or the, if, if this is your ex's family, male or female, divine masculine, divine feminine, because both of y'all are coming out here. These people are mad because they couldn't throw you in jail. They couldn't fucking destroy you. And everything that they tried to uh, do to you is happening to them. They're falling in the hole that they tried to dig for you. Yeah. Yeah, emperor card somebody is mad because divine feminine is with this sexy ass man that takes care of you that loves you that feeds you grace and give you back shots or this man finna be okay if you're not already with this man you finna be if you're not already with this woman you finna be bro somebody is mad because you're with your divine counterpart somebody keeps trying to block somebody's love life ten of swords here coming out again eight of swords here somebody wants you in jail divine masculine divine feminine somebody wants you ugly and broke and bummy and dusty and trashy just like them yeah, look, this seven of wands just keeps coming out. Look at this shit. Seven of wands here. It just keeps coming out, bro. It's, look at all these motherfucking people. I cannot make this up. All of these goddamn people keep attacking one person. And you still killing these motherfuckers. I wouldn't be surprised if the temperance card didn't come out. Okay, yeah, Knight of Stabs here. It keeps coming out, bro. Somebody's divine counterpart lives overseas, and they got a major fucking offer for you. I feel like somebody's going to come in like a thief in the night. Two of Cups here, confirmation. This is your divine counterpart. They're in love. They're in love with you. This is the emperor to the motherfucking empress. This is your divine counterpart. They love you. They care about you, and somebody is jealous. Your family is jealous. This part, your ex is jealous. This I, I don't know what this is. Hermit card here. You could be somewhere in Hermit. Virgo energy, minding your business. Yeah, Ace of Cups here coming out twice. Somebody is mad. Three of Swords here because you're not heartbroken. You're blessed. You're blessed and you're abundant. You're handsome and fucking wealthy. The Migos could be significant. 
Okay, I don't know. I keep picking up on Cardi B and Offset. Yeah, Nine of Pentacles here. Okay, I feel like you're somewhere self-sufficient, abundant. You're in hermit mode and you're minding your fucking fucking business. Somebody is mad because they can't get in your business. Somebody wants you to call them. Somebody could be doing spell work for you to get, for you to reach out to them, for you to call them. Somebody wants you to tell them your business so they can see how they can attack you. Somebody ain't got no information on you. They're mad because they don't know your business and they can't fucking atta attack you. Okay, somebody is a loser. Yeah, Two of Cups here. Somebody's divine counterpart is definitely here. And your number 444222, you and your divine counterpart, yeah. 444 four, four and 222 could be significant, but you and your divine counterpart is definitely going to come together in divine timing. Yeah, six of cups here. Somebody is a fucking loser, bro. Six of wands here. This is somebody that you moved on from. You don't want this person. This person is under judgment or these people are under judgment. What did I tell you? Chariot card here. Yeah, five of wands here coming out again. Somebody is mad because they cannot cause you chaos and drama. This is your energy. The ace of cups coming out twice and the ace of pentacles. This is your goddamn energy. You're going to remain this way self-sufficient, abundant, beautiful, sexy, or handsome, period. And you deserve love and you deserve to be with somebody that spoils you, that takes care of you, that give you back shot and feeds you grapes and travels with you and whatever the fuck. Yeah, uh, magician card here. I feel like somebody is mad because they chose somebody else over you. Remember to take what resonate, leave what don't, because I'm picking up on different storylines, you guys. Keep up. Yeah, will, in a, will of fortune here. Somebody is mad because they're stuck in karmic view. They're going through karma. They're going through judgment. I feel like every time this person or these people fucking attack you, you get double blessed. Look at these ace of cups coming out twice and you finna get an ace of pentacles i feel like this ace of pentacles is sitting in the spirit it's finna manifest in the physical with your divine counterpart when you and your divine counterpart come together in divine timing i'm hearing angel number two 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 four 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 and eleven eleven is significant yeah look at all these motherfucking snakes with the magician you see the snake here angel number eight could be significant 808 and 888 that represents abundance look at all these motherfucking snakes that don't want two people to come together look at all this yellow i'm exposing this shit it's a bunch of losers that's doing spell work over a union as well this could be your mother this could be your father this could be family members exes a community co-workers whatever the fuck somebody is mad because you're going to be with a wealthy man and you're going to be a world-renowned star what did i tell you lover's card here somebody is mad because you're going to be with a wealthy man a wealthy woman i might need to pull something from my kipper deck page of swords here knight of cups here somebody is mad because you don't want their shitty ass offer somebody thought that they could cheat on you and mistreat you and call you out your name and fucking abuse you you fucking narc male or female somebody thought that they could treat you any kind of way and play out in the field and fucking suck and i don't know somebody like to fucking suck hoes and fucking suck prostitutes Somebody is a gay bitch. Somebody is jealous of a woman, bro. Or somebody is jealous of a man. Somebody thought that they could fucking abuse you and then come back to you when they when they get ready. But instead, you moved on from this person. Yeah, nine of stabs here. Now somebody is living in fear because they're the ones facing jail time. They're the ones finna pass away because I'm definitely seeing the Grim Reaper here. Will of Fortune here. Same cards keep coming out. Ten of Cups here. Three of Pentacles. What did I... Wow, bro. Ten of Pentacles here. Three of Swords here. Same cards keep coming out, bro. I cannot make this up. Three of Cups here. This this person or these people thought that they were going to celebrate your demise, but instead you're a fucking star or you're destined to be a star. You people love and admire you. Somebody is jealous of that. Somebody is jealous because people love you. They actually like you. They actually care about you. Don't nobody care about this person. Don't nobody like this person. People hate to see this person come and they hate this person. This person is an evil fuck. Nobody likes this person. I feel like you was the only fucking person that liked it, this person and cared about this person. And this person betrayed you. They mistreated you. Somebody is a fucking narc a gay bitch and a loser knight of cups here coming out again two of pentacles here somebody is pinching pennies somebody ain't got a pot to piss in or a window to throw it out of this could be a whole fucking family with the ten of cups this could be a whole fucking family stand with one family member that's what i'm seeing yeah six of cups six of swords here one second you guys hold on let me fix this tv hold on i'm sorry about that you guys my phone had went dead and it uh i told you i got the uh, roku remote on my phone and it's real sensitive so if the phone go dead or i like accidentally touch it or it shake it'll like cut the tv off but anyways back to the reading wow tower card like i was saying there could literally be a whole family full of motherfuckers that's living in one house and i feel like this house is about to go into foreclosure that's could that could be somebody's karma if your ex was fucking attacking you male or female this person could have had to move back in with their family when you broke up with them or kicked them the fuck out divine masculine divine feminine and i feel like this person and their whole motherfucking family is suffering for doing death magic on you spell work on you wow this is that group of people that i picked up on like maybe a year or two ago year or two ago 
where I talked about it was a whole family full of fat motherfuckers, or they could be skinny, I don't know, but I picked up on a whole family full of motherfuckers that went to a graveyard and got graveyard magic and, you know, being got graveyard dirt and did graveyard magic on a chosen one. I'm, I feel like this shit is resurfacing. It's backfiring. Backfiring. It could be a whole group of fucking people. This could be a whole family full of motherfuckers that's living in one house and this house is going to go into foreclosure. I'm hearing something about child molestation, some type of child rape. I'm even hearing something something about incest. Wow. I'm telling y'all, wow. Hangman here coming out again. Seven of cups coming out of here again. Yeah. Nine of swords here. Three of cups here coming out twice. Angel number three, three, three could definitely be significant, bro. I'm telling you, I picked up on a whole family that's into incest. It's a family full of motherfuckers that live in one house and they all sleep, sleep together. They have orgies and threesomes. They invite strangers over and random fucking people and sleep with these people. And they also sleep with each other. This is a group of weirdos. I swear to God, I'm not making this up. If you don't think that incest is real, you need to wake up. This is a family. These people are related. All 10 of these motherfuckers are 20 motherfuckers. They all live in one house and they all fuck on each other. And they invite people over and they sleep with them. This is a group of weirdos. I feel like somebody's whole family is going to be exposed for incest. Divine masculine, divine feminine. This is what I'm hearing. If you, if you never got along with your ex-lover's family, male or female, I feel like these people didn't like you because they couldn't sleep with you. These people didn't like you because you didn't participate in orgies and threesomes. See, I'm seeing a lot of threesomes here with the three of cups. These people didn't like you because they couldn't sleep with you. You didn't, you, maybe you don't do drugs. Somebody could come from a family where they do cocaine, heroin, crack. These people are into drugs and incest. I'm hearing somebody could be from down south. Somebody could be from Alabama. Somebody could be from Mississippi. Somebody could be from Tennessee. Somebody could be from Nashville. Somebody could be from Memphis. I'm hearing something about the slave trade. I'm hearing something about buck breaking. This could be a white family or this could be a black family. You know, like a lot of people that have incest in their family, it comes from slavery. And I don't want to get into all of that shit. But you know, incest, it comes from slavery. It comes from people, you know, back in the day, the slave masters used to rape the the um, the black males in front of the uh, the women and the children. And they also used to rape the women. And then, you know, late at night, some of the slave masters' wives, they would sneak into the cabins and sleep with the men and the women. So all of that incest and shitting, you know, they call it buck breaking. Like during the slavery times, they had sex farms and shit. So I feel like that's what this is. I'm not going to get into all of that because I don't want to talk about about that but I feel like this is some type of generational curse whoever your ex is or this could even be your own fucking family I don't know but I sure don't come from a family like this but whoever the fuck your ex is male or female somebody comes from a family full of incest these motherfuckers sleep with each other they have orgies and fucking threesomes and they're mad because they couldn't get you to do it they're mad because I don't know maybe you never knew this I don't know Maybe you couldn't figure out why somebody's family didn't like you or whatever because they couldn't fuck you. Somebody's family is into sleeping with, yeah, somebody, I don't know. Somebody could have been molested by their own mother. Something that's going to be exposed about an incestuous family, like real talk. Yeah, seven of pentacles here. Somebody is mad because they can't block your manifestations. I'm starting to get sick at the stomach. I don't want to talk about that no more. Eight of cups here. Somebody is mad because you walked away from them, walked away from them. This could definitely be an ex- I'm finna get another deck, you guys. Yeah, uh, you guys, everything that I'm saying is the truth. <clears throat> Let me get another deck. And y'all gotta forgive me, y'all, because uh, my words be getting discombobulated because it's like when I get downloads, my mouth be moving faster than my downloads. <clears throat> and then also, you know, people don't want me speaking. You know, they want me to shut the fuck up. People constantly do spell work on my channel too, you guys. Somebody definitely is finna pass away. I'm hearing this song by uh, uh, not Boys to Men. Yeah, I'm hearing the song. No, that's I'm hearing that song by Drew Hill. I'm actually hearing three songs. I'm getting three song downloads. I'm hearing that song by Boys to Men, a song for Mama. Mama, you know I love you. I'm hearing that song. That song could be significant. Somebody's family is definitely jealous of them and attacking them, or somebody's mother or father or parents. I'm picking up on karmic parental figures as well. I'm also picking up on that song um, by Drew Hill. Um, five Steps. 
Somebody finna pass away from eternity. We were four steps. The devil finna collect somebody. Four steps past love and three wishes. Somebody need to go look up that song. Somebody is finna pass away from an incurable STD or something like that. I mean, I'm finna go ahead and pray again because I'm getting sick at the stomach and I'm starting to pick up on some real negative energy. The movie Friday After Next could be significant. All of the Friday series could be significant. Okay, somebody could be on the run from the police. Somebody could be on the run from a group of niggas. So I feel like there is a group of thug niggas that's looking for somebody that's trying to sacrifice somebody or this could be an occult. If somebody put you up as a blood sacrifice, this occult is now trying to sacrifice this person because they couldn't complete the sacrifice sacrifice or this is a group of hood niggas or somebody owed a dope man some money or somebody owed somebody some money somebody could be on drugs and alcohol somebody could be a female or a male prostitute somebody could be in and out of jail or they facing jail time i don't know justice card here let me get another deck you guys and i'm also picking up on another song i just can't think of the tune uh, oh, yeah, duh. Though I'm missing you. Yeah, that song could be significant as well. There could be a bunch of people that's uh trying to go on the run. Let me go ahead and pray, bro. I just don't get people. I really don't understand these karmic ass energies. Wow, well, Page of Cup Spirit told me to leave that right there for a second. I'll find a way to get through living without you cause you are my sister my strength and my pride I don't even feel like singing <laughs> only God may know why still I will get by who would have known that you have to go on the like singing. Let me get another deck, bro. But yeah, I'm, I'm picking up on deaths. Somebody could be attacking somebody's children with this page of cups. This is why Spirit told me to leave this out. Okay, somebody could be attacking their own fucking children. This could be your baby mama or your baby daddy, or somebody could have did this shit in the past, or this could be your ex-husband or your ex-wife. Somebody is going to die or pass away for attacking their own fucking children, or this could be your mama or daddy that's been attacking you. Somebody is going to pass away. Somebody is about to be physically removed from this earth. That's why I'm picking up on this song. That's why I keep picking up on all these sad-ass songs, Five of Cups here. Yeah, somebody is in regret because, not because of how they treated you. Somebody is in regret because they going to jail. They getting caught they're up under judgment by the universe by the most high god somebody is getting their ass kicked for trying to sacrifice you devil card here capricorn energy somebody is a fucking loser i'm being told to pull something from my kipper deck yeah message of concern you're gonna get a message of concern about these, this false ass person these false ass family members ex-lovers ex-friends i'm telling you you're gonna hear about somebody dying or passing away look at this shit don't it look like the grim reaper the grim reaper finna come get somebody there's several people that's gonna be physically fucking removed from this earth for trying to sacrifice you for trying to get rid of you and i feel like some of these people are still fucking attacking you because they're a loser or they could have attacked you in the past and now they're finally getting their karma yeah a sudden wealth here official person this is you this is your sudden wealth this is your ace of pentacles and these people are in despair this community that you live in this town this neighborhood or whatever the fuck message card here yeah message of concern and message card i'm telling you expect expectation here and whoever the fuck this person is, this woman is, this elderly ass bitch, somebody need to get the fuck out of your house or they finna get kicked out. They finna be removed. Somebody's finna be, somebody is finna be kicked out of your house. If somebody stole a house or a home from you, they're going to be kicked out of this house by the feds or I don't know, this house is going into foreclosure. I'm definitely picking up on a home that's going into foreclosure. Closure. Somebody is struggling to pay their bills. Yeah, journey card here because they stole this house from you or somebody can't pay the property taxes. I don't know what the fuck this is or somebody can't afford the upkeep. I feel like somebody got a bunch of junk in their house. Okay, somebody could have stole your inheritance. Somebody could have stole money out of a wheel. Somebody could have stole this house or they stole your money and got a house built from the ground and they purchased all this lavish ass furniture, all this bullshit, TVs and couches and all type of furniture and shit. And I feel like this raggedy ass, luxury ass furniture is going to be on the curb right along with this bitch because somebody's house is going into fucking foreclosure. Okay, and I feel like some of you are going to be with a wealthy man, a wealthy woman, the, I'm hearing the privileged lady and the wealthy man, imprisonment, 
apart. Here, these people are going to jail. Concern here. And these people are still worried about you. These people are still trying to figure out how the fuck they can sacrifice you. Mature man here. This could even be your father that's attacking you. This wealthy man could be your father. This is the man that's been attacking you. Or this could be a baby father or whatever the fuck. Or a baby mother. Or this could be your own mother. I don't know. Just take what resonates. Leave what don't. These people are in bad health. And they're heading to poverty. Because this is what they wanted for you. They wanted a chosen one. A divine being. A star seed. An earth angel. A walking avenger angel. In fucking poverty. But no. You finna get sudden wealth. Anything that somebody stole from you. I told you. Great fortune. These people stole your great fortune. And I feel like somebody wants to be you. Somebody is mad. And I, I'm telling you, it's a group of people that's planning to go on the run. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles here. I told you confirmation. Eight of Pentacles here. Magician card here. Ten of Pentacles here. Ten of Cups here. Confirmation after confirmation. One second, real quick. <clears throat> sorry about that you guys but like I said it's a whole fucking community of people that's going to jail for sending, for stealing this ten of pentacles I feel like whatever this great fortune is that's this ten of pentacles these people stole this from you they took this from you I'm tired of this shit coming back and it's, I mean, I'm tired of this shit coming out this money is coming back to you this ace of pentacles this sudden wealth this is something that your family did your family stole your inheritance your mother your father whatever the fuck this is I'm tired of this coming out Okay, whoever this wealthy man, I'm seeing two wealthy men here. One of these wealthy men could be your divine counterpart and one of these wealthy men could be your father or a baby father or a baby mother or a, or a mother or ex-wife or whatever the fuck. There's definitely ex-lovers and family members here that keeps attacking somebody. These people are losers. They're mad because they sorry ass spell work not working. I don't want to read on, 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 the, on this shit no more. Yeah, page of swords here. This is a bunch of gang stalking, illegal surveillance. It happens to me. It happens to all the chosen ones. I don't want to read on this shit. Yeah, eight of wands here. And be careful of somebody trying to reconcile with you and reach out to you. Yeah, two of cups here. Somebody knows that you have a divine counterpart coming in. So somebody wants to reconcile with you, reach out to you so they can destroy and ruin your life because they're in the five of pentacles. They're broke as fuck. And they refuse to sell on the comma water. Somebody is a gay bitch. Three of pentacles here. Yeah, somebody keeps working in cahoots to try to destroy you and sabotage you and nothing seems to be working. There's also some type of occult here. Some type of religious occult or masons or eastern stars somebody wants you to join their fraternity or somebody wants you to join their sorority uh, i don't know have you ever been to college because I, I haven't i thought people join sororities or fraternities when they go to college how some random person gonna join a sorority or a fraternity if they ain't never been to fucking college or somebody thinks they're better than you because they've been to college bitch you're not better than nobody because you got a, a a college degree bitch that don't make you better than nobody that don't make you more smarter than nobody it's a lot of smart people walking around you don't have to have a college degree or a college education to be smart, bitch. I don't know. Somebody thought you were dumb or maybe somebody thought I was dumb. I keep picking up on dumb energy. These people think we real slow, dumb, and stupid. Ain't nobody slow or dumb, bitch. You are. You're dumb. You got a whole fucking college degree and you're still dumb. Not hating on nobody, on nobody that got a college degree. Good. Good for you. Do your thing. But don't don't think you're better than somebody because you have a degree or you're a you're an Eastern star or you're a fraternity brother or a sorority sister. I'm hearing something about an AKA. Somebody could be an AKA, bitch. I feel like somebody is mad because this could be a female organization. Or this could be a male organization, but I'm picking up on a female organization. There is a group of AKAs that's mad because you don't want to join. And I feel like ain't now one of these bitches reached out to me or reached out to you, whoever the fuck this is for. Ain't nobody reached out to us and said, hey, do you want to join? They just, they just assume. I feel like these people know you're not going to join because they serve the devil. I feel like somebody wants you to join so they can steal your spiritual gifts. Somebody thinks you do spell work and kitchen magic. We don't do spell work and motherfucking kitchen magic. We believe in the most high God. Our help and our gifts comes from God, bitch. So since you don't want to join, even though they ain't never reached out to you, since you don't want to join this occult, this secret organization, they're going to attack you and try to block and stop your work. I don't know. This could literally be a group of uh, Masons and Eastern Stars, fraternity sorority sisters that's attacking people on YouTube, attacking people on TikTok. These people are mad because they want to steal your spiritual gifts. I'm seeing a whole group of women that sit behind the scenes and attack somebody. They attack terriers. Yeah, hangman here, but they, they stuck looking stuck. You look stuck and stupid, bitch. You look slow, ho. Dumbass bitches. I'm, I'm seeing a group of AKA. Somebody is an AKA. It's a group of these hoes. 
that's obsessed with a terrier, probably obsessed with me or obsessed with a bunch of terriers. That fucking AKA shit, fraternity, sororities, that shit is demonic. That Greek mythology, all of that shit is fucking demonic. Yeah, Wheel of Fortune here. And I feel like these AKAs, these AKA hoes, they're all up under judgment. They're all going through karma. Somebody think they're powerful as fuck. Yeah, Seven of Pentacles here, Star Card here. Somebody is trying to switch destinies with somebody. What the fuck is this? I'm picking up on a whole nother storyline. Somebody is trying to switch destinies with somebody. Yeah, but I feel like this person is blocked. I'm telling you, this could be a copycat ass bitch. This could be the mother daughter duo that I keep picking up on. I don't know. I'm hearing something about the bloodline. Come, somebody comes from a demonic ass bloodline. There could literally be an AKA bitch. This AKA bitch and her AKA ass, AKA ass daughter keeps attacking a divine, a divine feminine. This mother daughter duo. These retarded ass bitches want divine feminine to join their organization or whatever the fuck. Bitch, ain't nobody finna join this demonic ass shit. Three of swords here. And I feel like these two retarded ass bitches is attacking a divine feminine over a man. Or they could have been in the... I don't know. What is this? Emperor card here. What the fuck is this? What is this? Yeah, it's a justice card here. It's, it's several people here that's finna go to jail. I cannot make this up, bro. Several fucking people is going to jail, especially this gay ass King of Wands. This is a gay ass bitch that likes to take it up the ass. Somebody is a, a sick fuck, you sick bitch. That's why you're attacking a divine feminine because you're a sick gay bitch. And I'm not talking about the LGBTQ community. This is somebody that's on the down low and an evil. This is a tyrant. This is an evil gay bitch. This is somebody's father or this is somebody's baby father or ex-husband or I don't this could be your own fucking father whatever the fuck this is somebody is a gay bitch and a loser somebody could be attracted to their own daughter on their own son somebody is also a child molester so somebody is going to jail for raping a fucking child or I don't know or this mother daughter duo could be lying on this man or lying on this woman I don't know what this is if you're resonating with this put this in the comment section six of pentacles here now somebody wants to apologize but they don't even got shit to offer I feel like somebody is broke as fuck I feel like even if somebody wanted to offer something, they can't offer nothing. Somebody wants to steal your shit. Somebody wants to stop and block your destiny. Somebody wants to keep you from your great fortune in this wealthy man. I feel like there is a whole group of people that could have worked with a community. They could have worked with your family and a cult. I don't know what this is. Angel number 333 could be significant. Uh, somebody could be 33 years of age. The year 2025 could be significant. Project 25 could be significant. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's a mother-daughter duo that keeps coming out. Five of Wands, so they keep trying to cause chaos and drama. I'm picking up on AKA, this is a group of AKA hoes. I'm telling you, don't nobody want to join this demonic ass shit, or this is a group of fraternity brothers. You're not high rank. You're not fucking royalty, bitch. How many more motherfucking times do I got to keep saying this shit? I am Nefertiti reincarnated ho. Whoever watching me or anybody else, bitch, I never joined no AKA shit. I never joined the Eastern Stars, bitch. I'm powerful on my own, bitch. So you ho ass hoes and niggas, you sit behind the scenes and you attack fucking tear readers and you try to steal their anointing, you try to steal their spiritual gifts. And somebody could be from fucking Houston, or somebody could be from San Antonio, or somebody could be from fucking Georgia or Chicago. Somebody can be anywhere from anywhere. Somebody definitely travels a lot, and somebody can definitely be a truck driver. I feel like it's a whole community of people. You're going to fucking jail for illegally gang stalking somebody, hiring fake lovers and fake people, whatever the fuck this gang stalking bullshit is you're also going to jail for stealing somebody's inheritance stealing some type of lump sum of money you're all going to fucking jail bitch and i will continue to fucking expose you and expose you and expose you till i can't fucking expose you no more ten of swords here archangel michael here temperance card here we're not your blood sacrifices what the fuck don't you understand and i'm most definitely not yeah page of wands here now somebody want to reach out now somebody want to send a message bitch what is this Yeah, higher fin here. Look at the most high God. He's still protecting us, chosen one. Somebody is mad because you're chosen. I'm telling you, I don't know what this AKA shit is, is that I'm picking up on. I keep picking up on this shit. I'm seeing the colors pink and green. I'm seeing somebody do this. Don't them AKA hoes stand like this? Or I don't fucking, I don't know what them AKA hoes do. And not all of them are demonic. 
Okay, not all of them are demonic. I'm not saying that, but most fraternities and sororities, them people are evil and fucking demonic. That Greek mythology shit, that's not even black history. I don't know. I, I don't know. Yeah, look, moon car here. It's a lot of shit going on behind the scenes, and y'all can literally be in hermit mode in the nine of pentacles, ace of pentacles, whatever the fuck. You're in the you're in the you're in the ace of pentacles, ace of cups, ace of swords here. Spirit said that's the truth. Yeah, three of swords here in the I mean three of wands here in the reverse. Somebody is trying to block your destiny by doing death magic and spell spell work, hoodoo, voodoo, kitchen magic. Somebody do a lot of fucking kitchen magic. This karmic ass copycat bitch. This mother daughter duo. I don't know what the fuck this is. Yes, yeah, seven of wands here. Same cards keep coming out. Two of pentacles here. World card here. It's gonna be a completion. All these motherfucking people going up against one person and you still losing, bitch. I know one thing. I gotta get a regular fucking Roku remote. I had I had I had my Roku remote and I had actually threw that hoe in the trash. And I had to download that fucking Roku app. I had to download the fucking app and put it on my phone for, so I can have the remote. Yeah, nine of swords here. I'm gonna go uh do that real quick again uh, in a second, you guys. Yeah, nine of swords here, six of wands here. Somebody is worried about the wrong thing. This group of fucking people, somebody is jealous and envious because you're loved and you're admired, you're in the public eye. I'm telling you, same cards coming out. Ten of wands, somebody wants you to carry a heavy burden. This is not your burden to carry. These people are going through karma, they're facing jail time, their house is going into foreclosure, they're gonna get kicked out of they fucking home they're going to prison they going to the motherfucking feds period point blank yeah chariot car here hold on you guys okay sorry about that you guys y'all see this fucking remote <laughs> this shit has gotten on my last nerves i'm i'm gonna have to order a remote this shit <laughs> and my motherfucking daughter y'all she the tv <laughs> My daughter is just like me. Both of them is just like me. They both goofy and, and silly and shit. But yeah, you see how many times I had to stop the video to fix that? This shit is so sensitive. I don't know if y'all got a Roku remote, but this shit is sensitive. But anyways, y'all, let me let me get some more closing messages and I'm finna close this out. Um I don't know. I don't know what this fraternity is or this sorority is, bitch, but we not joining. I'm definitely not joining. So since you don't want to motherfucking join, somebody keeps trying to attack you and block your blessings. I don't know what this is, but somebody is definitely a AKA. Somebody is a part of a sorority. Somebody is a part of a fraternity. I don't know what the fuck this is. Somebody is a loser. We don't want to join. I don't want to join. Nobody wants to join this shit. Let me get another deck and I'm going to uh, close this message out. Baroque, I cannot get that song out of my head. You ain't never fuck with no boss, bitch. I turn chat. <laughs> Lotto. <laughs> that shit is all over fucking TikTok. I like that song, though. Baroque. fucking aka bitch ain't nobody finna join this shit i don't know and somebody can definitely be from houston somebody so I, I ain't never been well i've been to houston one time when i was a little girl maybe one or two times but somebody could definitely be from houston <clears throat> Yeah, King of look, King of Pentacles with the fucking Emperor, bro. Somebody is mad because you finna be with your divine counterpart as well, or you're already with this King of Pentacles. I'm literally seeing somebody on an island or on a beach, somebody feeding you grapes, somebody wanna give you back shots. And your karmic ass ex, your baby daddy, your baby mama, somebody is mad because you having good sex, you getting some good P-U-S-S-Y or some good D-I-C-K. Somebody is fucking mad because they're in the five. Five of swords. Somebody could have got somebody pregnant on you or somebody could have got pregnant by somebody with the ace of wands here. Okay, yeah, five of cups. There's somebody who's just a fucking loser here. Yeah, temperance card here. I feel like, yeah, Archangel Michael is here as well. Ten of cups. This is your karmic ass family, ex-lovers, a community, a Nicole, AKAs, Eastern stars. These are karmic ass motherfucking people attacking you, doing death magic on you, trying to ruin you, sabotage 
inside you. Attack your work, attack your home, attack your beauty. World card here, and it's going to be a fucking completion. It's going to be a completion. Eight of Wands here, and you could be somewhere in Herman mode, resting and rejuvenating with the Eight of Wands here. Be careful of somebody trying to reach out to you, reconcile with you. Be careful because somebody is definitely rushing in. This Queen of Wands or this King of this Queen of this could this could literally be a man. This queen of wands could be a man. This could be some karmic ass nigga. This, this nigga is gay. Somebody is a gay bitch. Or somebody could be in a relationship with a transgender or whatever the fuck. Or this could be a transgender man that's attacking you or whatever. Or a transgender woman. Whatever the fuck. Yeah, king of cups here. I'm telling you, somebody is trying to rush in and love bomb somebody. Because they facing jail time or I don't know. I don't know what the fuck this is. Queen of swords here. Cut this person off or keep this person come cut off. Yeah, with the ace of cups, five of pentacles. Because somebody wants your blessings. Pay of wands here somebody wants to send you a message because they're stuck this is somebody that you moved on from same cards coming out this is somebody that you moved on from this is somebody from your past justice card here somebody is facing jail time for illegally gang stalking you stealing from you trying to sacrifice you doing death magic death spells on you yeah six of wands here and you somewhere loved and admired somebody is mad because you're loved and you're admired you're in the public eye you're moving forward whatever the fuck somebody wants you to carry these burdens ten of wands look how the same cards keep coming out strength card here somebody is mad because you're strong you're powerful you're standing in your power three six seven yes seven of pentacles here you're manifesting five of cups here somebody is in regret this is somebody that lost you this is a friend or a family member that you don't fuck with no more somebody is mad somebody thought if they isolated you abandoned you that they would complete some type of sacrifice somebody thought that they were going to ruin you and sabotage you and keep you stuck and they did it yeah this is an ex-lover of yours or somebody that claimed that they loved you and cared about at you your mama your daddy your sister your brother your cousin your friend you also can have a jealous ass cousin i don't know yeah, Ten of Pentacles here, Two of Cups here. These people are just mad because you're getting money and you're with your divine counterpart. These people are mad because you're not heartbroken. Yeah, Two of Swords here. They can't come down your dwelling. They're blocked. I keep saying the same thing. Eight of Swords here. These people are facing jail time. They losing money. They 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 sick. They got incurable STDs, gravely ill disease. The star card here. Aquarius energy. These people are mad because you're a star. You're in the public eye or you're destined to be. They're suffering behind the scenes. Moon card here. Cancer energy devil card here capricorn energy because they cannot sacrifice you queen of pentacles and you focusing on your money period point blank and this queen of pentacles could also be some gold digging ass bitch some copycat ass hoe that wants to be you this could be somebody that your ex chose over you king with the king of pentacles and the queen of pentacles this could be a gold digging ass bitch or opportunist your male or female somebody chose somebody over you and they're stuck in karmic deal and they mad because they going through tower after tower and they can't ruin you and sabotage you knight of swords here this weak ass nigga or this weak ass bitch and you got an ace of pentacles coming to you yeah yeah, King of Swords here, this male Libra, this King of Wands. Somebody's a fucking loser and a gay bitch that likes to attack women. Eight of Cups here, they refuse to move on with their life. They're mad because you have a destiny. You're on the top of this wheel. Somebody is mad because they can't ruin you and sabotage you. Nine of Pentacles here, and you're self-sufficient abundant. These people are worried about the wrong thing. Fuck all these goddamn people. And somebody is mad because you're intuitive as well. Three of Cups here, somebody is mad because they can't celebrate your demise. And somebody is also a part of an incestuous family somebody is into incest somebody mama and daddy and female cousins and friends and brothers and sisters they all hate on you this is your karmic ass ex's family or this could be some random family or random people that you don't fucking know bro these people are into drugs and alcohol and orgies and threesomes everything that i said is the fucking truth period point blank six of pentacles here somebody is mad because they can't bread from you you're with your divine counterpart you're with your twin flame your high level soulmate are you finna be yeah Three, six, seven, eight. Yeah, eight of cups here. No, that's the nine of cups. Yeah, you're loving on yourself. You're loved. You're happy. You love yourself. Somebody is mad because you love yourself. You're in a relationship with a higher fin. Are you finna be? Somebody is just fucking mad. It's a bunch of mad ass people here that's stuck watching you from a distance. Period. Point blank. That's all this is. Ten of swords here. These people cannot sacrifice you. They can't play God in your life. They can't get rid of you. These people are up under judgment. The hole that they tried to dig for you, they fell in and they've already fallen in it. So the more you try to block and stop somebody's work, the more you try to block and stop and ruin somebody's life and keep them from their divine counterpart and keep them from getting to their destiny, you're going to go through judgment after judgment. Tower, I mean, you're going to go after, uh, you're going to go through tower after tower and you're going to remain under judgment, bitch, period, point blank. It is what it is. Yeah, sun card here. I exposed all this shit. 
Y'all got to forgive me. Y'all be multitasking. <laughs> yeah, page of sorts. You're all this gang stalking, illegal surveillance, and blah, 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 and blah, 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 and blah, 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 and blah, blah, blah. Empress card here. Three of pentacles here. It's a group of motherfucking people attacking the empress and attacking the emperor. Five of wands here trying to cause chaos, chaos and drama. Yeah, chaos, because somebody is gay as fuck. Yeah, knight of wands here. Shoot fly, don't fucking bother me. I belong to somebody. Shoot fly. Go the fuck away, bitch. Four of pentacles here, bro. I'm gone. I'm gone, you guys. That's it. I, I pretty much read the whole fucking deck. I didn't read all these decks. Thank y'all for being patient with me. I know I had to stop the video a bunch of times and shit. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm, I'm multitasking. I told you. I got this sensitive ass remote. I can't. <laughs> And then I need to go look in my fucking storage closet. I got another Roku remote in here somewhere. Y'all, I be in my house and shit. I get the cleaning up and I throw shit away. Look, you definitely got you definitely got an ace of pentacles coming in. Shit, it ain't shit else. I didn't read all three of these damn decks. It ain't shit else to say, y'all. <laughs> Shoe fly, don't bother me. Just know you're a chosen one and you're protected by the most high God. Shoe, yeah, win win outcome for the forecast. You are good enough. Uh, fiery climax approaches. You got a divine counterpart coming in. You got an ace of pentacles coming in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I told you a new romantic cycle begins. A fiery climax approaches. You got everything coming in. It's just a bunch of haters, bruh. And don't nobody want to join y'all retarded ass organizations. And the more you, I feel like it's a, it's a mother daughter duo. Or this could be some random bitches. Somebody is an AKA. I'm seeing the colors pink and green. Look at that. I cannot make this up. Pink and green. I'm seeing this shit. Somebody is mad because you don't want to join. And I feel like somebody know that you're not going to fucking join. I don't know if you're doing this to me or doing this to somebody. We don't want to fucking join your fucking bullshit. Move around. I feel like somebody knows that you don't want to join because you don't serve the devil. You serve the most high God. These people are devil worshipers. This church cult, because I'm also picking up on some church motherfuckers and I don't re feel like reading about, uh, yeah, reading on that shit. I don't. So I, that's it, you guys. I don't think there's nothing else that needs to come out. Is there anything else, Spirit? Because I'm finna go. Ain't nothing else. Anything else? Is there anything else you want me to read in this deck? I pretty much read the whole deck. Yeah, look, four wands here. I can't make this up. Somebody's gonna be fucking. I'm, I'm just with this. Look, I just keeping it real. I'm hearing, I'm hearing escape. Just kick it. Just kick it. Just kick. Yeah, you finna be kicking in with your man, girl. I'm hearing thank you to my man. That's my man. Somebody's divine masculine is a fucking boss. I feel like this is a whole nother storyline. This will be continued. Somebody's divine masculine is a fucking boss. This King of Pentacles Emperor. Uh, uh, I'm here. This is a King of Pentacles Emperor higher fan. Somebody is rich and somebody is wealthy. Somebody is handsome and fucking wealthy. And somebody can live overseas. Somebody can live in Colombia. Somebody can live in Jamaica. Somebody can live in Dubai. Somebody could be a Muslim. I'm literally hearing somebody seeing somebody pray and bow their head like this. Somebody could be a Muslim. Yeah, with the magician card here. Okay, somebody you could have manifested this person. Or you and this person could have manifested each other. This person is is in love with you and you're in love with this person or you finna be i'm telling you you might have to travel by boat to get to this person like you might have to travel by plane okay to get somewhere but when you get to your destination you're gonna have to go you're gonna have to get on a boat to get to a hotel or get to somebody's mansion i'm seeing that page of cups in my head somebody's gonna have a water birth i'm seeing this shit somebody's gonna have a water birth uh man this is gonna this is gonna be a beautiful fucking baby i'm seeing a beautiful ass baby bro Somebody is going to have a water birth and I'm seeing a little boy or this may be twins or this may be triplets. Okay, I'm, I keep hearing a divine, this is your blessing, Ace of Cups. I keep hearing a divine masculine say, look at daddy baby. That's daddy baby right there. Look at daddy baby. Somebody is a gangster too. And I'm not saying, I'm hearing I ain't no killer, but don't push me. Somebody is like two, Tupac Shakur. And I'm not just saying it because I'm a Tupac fan. I'm not talking about Tupac. This man, this higher fan, this emperor is like a is like Tupac Shakur. Somebody is real as fuck, and somebody is a protector and a provider. Somebody is a real ass man or a real ass woman. But I'm picking up on a man, and somebody is rich as fuck. Somebody is wealthy as fuck. I told you, Page of Cups here. I cannot make this out. Make this up. Didn't I? Yeah, y'all gonna be making out. Yeah, y'all definitely gonna be making out. 
Mm -hmm. I'm hearing put the lime in the coconut, coconut and mix it all up. I'm hearing something about a mimosa. I'm hearing breakfast in bed and woo. Look, I'm telling you, look at this divine masculine, this higher fit and this emperor. Look at daddy baby. That's daddy baby right here. That's baby daddy right. I mean, uh, daddy's baby right there. Yeah. Shit, this man might be saying, let me shut up. Shit, I'm literally seeing a man. I'm seeing somebody have a water birth. Look at this child. This is a beautiful ass star seed baby right here with the sun card. Okay, I'm literally hearing a man say, push, push, push. Come on, you got it, baby. Push, push. Come on, come on, push. And when you push, it's going to be a beautiful baby to come out. When? Maybe two or three babies that's going to come out. When? Look at this. This is a star seed child with the sun card. The sun card can represent children as well. Okay, look at this. Yeah. Wow, this is beautiful. Somebody is going to be pregnant with a spirit baby, a star seed. I'm literally hearing somebody say, push. This is going to be a royal wedding. Yeah, with the moon card here. This is going to shock the whole world. These people are not going to see this shit coming because they tried to sacrifice you. These are two chosen ones that's going to marry each other, that's going to have a spirit baby, a bunch of spirit babies. They may even have a blended family. Okay, yeah, this, this message will be continued. This message will be continued. Damn, this divine masculine is fine. God damn, and this man is rich as fuck. That wasn't even supposed to be in the deck. This man, my God, this man, is, and, and he's a hard worker. Yeah, this man is real as fuck with the justice card. This man is real as, this man is real. This man, I don't know. This, this message will be continued. Yeah, Archangel Michael is protecting this union, protecting this money, protecting your life from these karmic ass people. These karmic ass people are up under judgment for stealing some type of lump sum of money from you. This great fortune working in cahoots. This is why you're going to get an ace of pentacles. And even if you never receive this money that your family or these ex lovers or these community uh, of crooked local government officials or whatever the fuck, even if you never receive this money that these people stole from you, you're definitely going to have an ace of pentacles with your divine counterpart. You're definitely going to be world renowned star. Not all of you, some of you, okay? You're going to be rich and fucking famous, handsome and beautiful and fucking wealthy. Two of swords here. And these people can, be, can keep watching and stalking. It doesn't fucking matter. Somebody wants you hot, heartbroken. Somebody doesn't want this higher fence to see you. But this man or this woman, they see you anyways. You see each other. You're both chosen. Confirmation. Didn't I just say that? You're both chosen ones, okay? You're going to have a spirit baby or, or, or a bunch of spirit babies or a blended family if you already got children or you're probably going to have more children. Yeah, Will of Fortune. You're literally going to be at the top of this wheel. Two motherfucking chosen ones are going to be at the top of this wheel winning world-renowned stars. I'm telling you, this is going to shock the whole world. We gon' show the world. Ten of Cups, bro. Everybody going to be hating on this relationship. The definition of real. Yeah. Boosie could be significant. I ain't got nothing bad to say about Boosie. I'm going to just leave it at that. Shout out to his daughter and shit. I fuck with Boosie, even though I don't fuck with Boosie, but I fuck with Boosie. Any fucking ways, yeah, I gotta go, bro. And somebody do not play about their wife. Somebody do not play about their divine feminine. This is a man that's in a devil energy. And this is not a bad devil. This is somebody that has had to get in devil energy. This is somebody that has been ordained by God because people keep fucking with this man's empress. Somebody does not play about the fucking empress. Just like the empress don't play about divine masculine. But this man, these these divine masculines, these are real men. And somebody is like Tupac Shakur, bro. Somebody is real as fuck, fine as fuck. Somebody is a boss. Somebody is ham handsome. Somebody Somebody is wealthy. I keep picking up on baguettes. Ohio, I don't know. Those are earrings or something. Somebody got a lot of jewelry, a lot of cards, a lot of clothes. Somebody, but they're humble though. This is somebody that's frugal. They're not cheap. They're frugal. This is somebody that manages their money very well. Somebody is a boss, bro. Somebody is a fucking boss, bro. Somebody, I just seen the two of cups again. Somebody is just a boss. It's two chosen ones sitting in the chariot that's going to take off, bro. And whoever this king of wands is, this gay ass bitch, yo ex, whoever the fuck this, this is a gay ass bitch right here. Somebody is a loser, bro. I don't know. This could even be somebody's ex divine counterpart. You could have literally had a divine counterpart that had a fall from grace. And now the most high God is going to bless you with your high level soulmate. Whoever this false ass twin is or this false ass divine counterpart, this motherfucker is stuck in Carmenville. Somebody is facing jail time or they're facing life in prison for killing one of their friends or killing one of their family members or what? Or, or somebody could have been set the fuck up good for them. I feel like this is somebody's karma for doing spell work on you. I'm picking up on a whole nother storyline or whatever the fuck. Yeah, three of wands here in the reverse. 
tired from telling you this this weird ass nigga a bitch is stuck in Carmenville. This is somebody's ex. This could be, uh, or if this is not your ex, this is somebody that was supposed to be your twin flame or somebody that was supposed to be your divine counterpart. And they tried to sacrifice you or they tried to do spell work on you with their karmic ass wife or baby mama or, or ex or whatever the fuck this is. Somebody is up under judgment for that shit. I don't know. I don't know. This I gotta go. I ain't gonna, I'm gonna be on here all motherfucking day. All right, you guys, I gotta go. I have to go. I love you guys. Thank you for watching my channel. Thank you for all the love and the support. And let me say this shit before I go. Do not type in my comment section acting like you fuck with me and you know you don't fuck with me because I can pick up on your energy. Excuse me, spiritual burp. I can pick up on your energy. Don't type in my comment section talking about stay strong. I'm not going through anything, bitch. Because I know me personally, I got a lot of karmic family members and ex-friends and ex-family members that I don't fuck with. Don't type in my comment section telling me to stay strong. Stay strong for what? Because I'm not going through shit. I may have went through shit in the past, but I'm not going through shit now, bitch. Your spell work ain't working. Stay strong. I, bitch, yeah, I'm, a, I'm strong as hell. I'm a strong ass woman because I'm a divine feminine. But just because I expose you or call you the fuck out don't mean that the message. I'm talking about the message that I did yesterday. Just because I expose y'all, y'all or call y'all the fuck out, don't mean that your spell work is working, and don't mean that I'm in I'm in survival mode. I'm not struggling, bitch. You are a bitch. I'm not being strong. I'm strong because God protects me, bitch. I'm not strong because I'm in survival mode. I feel like somebody want me and a whole collective of people to be in survival mode and struggling and suffering. I feel like they get your rocks off, bitch. Two of cups here. Yeah. Um, let me go ahead and end this. Y'all are worried about the wrong thing. But yeah, I'm gone. Like, subscribe, and share. Peace.